Good morning. It's Monday. A beautiful Monday. Thank God for waking up this morning. I hope you all say the same thing too. Um, I just wanted to give you a follow-up on my hormonal acne treatment. As you can see, my face had cleared up. No more. Acne is coming out. The treatment from my dermatologist is working very well. Thank God for Jesus. I already mentioned the treatment in a prior video. For those of you that's suffering with any kind of acne, I suggest you go to your dermatologist and let them tell you what kind it is because I thought mine was, um, you know, regular acne or something like that, but it wasn't. My doctors who told me it was hormonal, hormonal. So it's on the inside, you know, and it's a form of bacteria. And that's why, you know, when you get those big old bumps, you have all this pus inside of it and all that kind of stuff. I know it sounds yicky, but it's true. And when they heal, you know, they leave this big old ugly mark on your face. Then you have so many of them. I thought it was sebaceous cysts, but it was hormonal acne. Anyway, I'm glad that I went to her because it was pissing me off. Every time I turn around, here comes a new one, here comes a new one. And I was like, what the heck, what is going on? But I'm glad I went. And I just wanna show you guys the treatment. It's Birkin, look at that. You know, it's a solution. It smells like alcohol. I rub it on my face twice a day. And then there's a cream the cream I get it from an online pharmacy that's where she sent me and you know the cream actually clears up the marks and any kind of you know marks that you have on your face the cream is really good but it's a strong solution so you know you have to use it sparingly twice a day and you must only put it on the areas where you have these acne marks. You can't put it on your forehead, around your eyes, around your nose and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So you have to be very cautious using it. And then there's a pill that you take. You only take that one pill at night, preferably night, because it causes... You know, it has side effects like drowsiness and kind of stuff like that. So, I haven't, um, I haven't gotten any of those, any of those, um, you know, complaints, you know, no drowsiness or dizziness or, or itching or nothing like that. So, it works for me. But, the pill is actually... Um, an antibiotic that cleans out your inside where the acne, the hormonal acne actually comes from on the inside, you know what I'm saying? It's with your hormones, you know, when you get older, you know, people go through this kind of stuff. So, some people get it on their chest or their back area, you know, mine was in my face. So, you know, I didn't like that. So, I had to nip it in the butt. So, as you can see, I'm here walking Mr. Hustle. It's a beautiful Monday morning. And I also wanted to share something with you. People, you have to be on the alert. You have to be on the lookout. When ordering food deliveries or any kind of deliveries that you get be very careful you know what I'm saying be very careful 
because some of these people are very dangerous. I was told about a young man that was killed. I'm not really clear about the whole story, but apparently he had a delivery, a food delivery. He went to his door to get it and the person came in and actually killed him. I don't know if it, he chopped him up or what. I, I think that's what I heard, but someone told me this story. But anyway, just just be on the lookout. Be careful ordering stuff, food, all this kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? You can't trust anyone these days. You just can't trust anyone, period. So, you know, I had a wonderful time yesterday. It was Easter. But I didn't make a video because I was up and out early and I went with my youngest granddaughter to get her hair done, you know what I'm saying. And that takes hours. And you can't make videos in everybody's house, so I didn't want to do it. Plus I already done a video of her getting her hair done, but that time it was braids. This time it's those um, dreads. And that would have been a nice video, but you know everyone doesn't like video so I didn't want to chance it you know plus my other granddaughter was like grandma do not make no videos in that girl house you know I was like OMG I'm not so you know I didn't do it but after that you know we left and the three of us we had a wonderful time it was a beautiful hot Sunday we drove around, we got something to eat, we brought it back home, and it was a lovely day, yes indeed. And over here in Florida, you know, people don't get all doozy up like they do in New York. I don't know if they still do, I'm quite sure they do, for Easter and all that kind of stuff, you know. Maybe some people do the Easter hunt and stuff like that, but I'm not aware of it, I haven't heard anything about it. But you know, it was a very nice layback day and I had a wonderful time. I hope you all did too. So forget about my hair, you know, I look like a ragamuffin. I didn't comb it this morning, you know, just trying to get Hustle out so he can use the bathroom. When I go back and I'll do my little grooming. But for now, I just wanted to share my update on my hormonal acne treatment progress. So this is J.U. Dash I saying, peace out for now. Enjoy your day. Those of you that's in the cold, stay warm. Eat and drink something hot. Not too hot where it's gonna burn your mouth, but you know what I mean. And keep smiling, keep shining everyone and think positive don't let the stress get you don't let the depression get you and keep on striving keep on striving may god bless all of you and if you like my video hit the like and subscribe button peace out for now people